Hello. <laughs> we got that hanging from the rafters. Hi everyone, it's Didi and Boris in the Mythical Forest. And this is just uh, to follow up on that segment of um, the... We're making what the is vinegar, this? vinegar, apple cider vinegar. But I decided that I'm not gonna ingest this because remember there was some mold on the vinegar on the top and this is my first time ever attempting. So what I'm gonna use it for is just for cleaning or something or like, um, like right now I'm using it, I'll show you. Right now I got a lot of fruit flies. So I'm using this as in the fruit fly traps. You just pour the vinegar, apple cider vinegar in there. So that's what I'm using it for right now. Um, and that's what I'm going to use it for because I don't want, I don't want to ingest this because I don't feel comfortable with the fact that it did have some, uh, that green bacteria in the top the first, when I first did the batch. So I let it go another week with removing that. And now, I don't know if you can see, but it now it has like white. Can you see the white? Which is okay. That's okay. The white. Oh, look, there's a, there's a sticker from the apple peel. <laughs> I didn't realize. Okay, so I'm going to strain this now. And I, I think I told you guys already that it had the coffee filter with the rubber band and just the water and the sugar and the uh, apple peels. So I've already labeled it's an old jar. It used to be apple cider vinegar, but I've labeled it homemade apple cider vinegar for bug traps, not drinking. That way I don't make a mistake and actually use it. Because I give apple cider vinegar to Boris for his acid reflux. And he always says, it's not reflux, it's reflex. And I'm like, no, it's reflux. So anyway, Boris is not here right now. He just left. So I'm going to try to Strain this without him holding the handle. Let's see if I don't spill it everywhere. So I'm just straining it. And I've got way more than is way more than I, uh, in this, I'm going to have to find another container because I got way more than I need. Oh, I always do that. It's going to overflow. Oh, it didn't overflow. <laughs> I did it right this time. So anyway, I've got to go get another container. I've got it all strained in here, and uh, whatever's left over, I only got one, but I'm going to put that in the compost. So, i got to go get me some more bottles and start filling them up. See you guys! I'm back! Okay, I had to uh, improvise here, because this is so shaky, I can't fill it by myself without it falling, so... I put it in this cup to stabilize it. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping I can stabilize it enough that it won't tip over. Almost. It definitely smells like apple cider vinegar, that's for sure. I'm so excited to try the next batch. And maybe do the next batch correctly. All right. Looks like I need to go get some more bottles. Hi everybody. Okay, um, so I had to uh, take a break so I could get all this stuff uh, poured out because th uh, this one I <laughs> almost spilled everywhere. Anyway, so I got it all labeled and this was just a big water bottle. Now it's labeled. And I wanted to show you something. Well, I washed. I was washing this, and I thought, ah, I should probably show everybody. So, 
sometimes if I'm going to have this big jar on my countertop, this granite countertop, I'm always afraid it's going to break. So I glued these little felt pads that you can get at the 99 cent store or the Dollar Tree or whatever. They're just little felt pads. I don't know if you can see them. I, I, I didn't glue them. They have sticky on them, so they stuck right on. And now it's, it doesn't clank. You see, when you put it down on the counter, it doesn't make that. I'm always afraid I'm going to break it, and it, it'll slide around good for, you know, like that. So, anyway, I just wanted to show you that little trick that I did because um, I was using this to store a special kind of water, and I was using it every day and moving it around and just, just putting it down, and it made me nervous. So, anyway, I thought that was something interesting y'all might want to try. Thank you for watching.